Tennessee. All you can eat. Woohoo! So we're excited to be here. We're gonna have a great time. We're here yeah. with our friends. We're gonna go check it out and take you along with us. It's a little hot today, so I'm ready. I'm ready for a beverage. Let's <laughs> do it. Let's go. We are Kim and Aaron, and this is Zach and Cody. We are best friends living and traveling full time in our renovated RV, Lucy. We have been on the road since October 2020, so please subscribe to join in on all the fun. KNERVTV, KNERVTV, sing it with us. Hops in the hills. There's a bunch of people are here already. It's from five to nine here in the park. And as soon as you walk in over here, already there's food. Oh yeah, yeah, you can do that. Doritos, rice and beans, chicken, beef. All the fixings. Started off with the nice uh, chicken taco here. Now I just need a drink to go with it. So they give you these uh, glass, little hops in the hills glasses, and that's what you get your free samples with. I'm going for the Pilsner. What's the name? It's uh, delightful and delicious tiny bomb Pilsner from oh. Lost Tiny bomb. <laughs> Lost Try some. I'm gonna drink it regardless. Aaron got the IPA. What'd you think? Gross. Gross? <laughs> I don't know why you get an IPA. I got the Pilsner and it's actually not bad. I wanted to try something else. We're not beer connoisseurs or anything. <laughs> I'm a Bud Light girl. Where's the Bud Light at? So there's a nice big field out here. People are playing cornhole. Some people brought their own chairs. At least I think they're their own chairs. I mean, we weren't told we were allowed to bring chairs. Not that we would have brought chairs. They have Jenga. This is where all the performers are going to be today in the amphitheater. It's a good amount of people here already, so we know the event is sold out. So I think there's going to be a lot of people here. We're going to be waiting in a lot of lines to get there. It's probably a good thing. Pineapple and vanilla sour. I'm down for that. Not no double IPA. Thank you. There you go. Cheers. I guess I only get this much. Okay, so I think it's a pineapple and vanilla sour, he said. Oh my god, it tastes like a pineapple upside down cake. Oh my god, guys, you didn't try this. So oh, good, it tastes like dessert. So they have water at every brew so you can rinse your cup out. What's this one? It's a whiskey smash inspired beer. Okay, I'll try that one. Thank you. So I got this whiskey inspired something kind of beer and it literally smells like whiskey. Smell it. Oh, it doesn't it, like it tastes a little bit like whiskey, but it's actually kind of good like a whiskey caramel yeah, kind like a whiskey caramel kind of taste All right, I will try the blonde please. Yes, you doing all right? Yes, sir Skin side. I'm trying the blonde 5.6 alcohol. Thank you. Enjoy, yeah. Ooh, we can get some stickers over here. So this is the blonde apple one. I got the strawberry banana one. Oh, I like that. It's definitely a little tart. Ooh, mine's a little sour. Strawberry banana sour. Okay. Yummy. Country Lager. Blackberry Farm Brewery. Yes, 
Thank you. This country lager is a little strong for a lager for me, but I guess I'll have to drink it. But everybody's here having a great time. I wish it was a little overcast. The sun is uh, beaming down on everybody. Kind of feel bad for the band. Shining right in their face. We're at the Fanatic Brewing Company. May I try the shandy, please? Thank you. Ooh, I got the shandy. Hope it's good. Mm, yeah, that's good. I could drink that for sure. Can I do the key lime? Yeah. I got a key lime beer. I'm jealous. Yeah. I have an American. It's kind of like a free for all. You just go with it in whatever line you want. Exactly. We're all just trying everything. I have an American light. It's really nice. I couldn't tell you which stand it was from. But it's good. I mean, it's good, but I don't know how much it is. The key lime. Try this one. You're so jealous. We're trying to get some shade under the trees along with everybody else. Shade is prime real estate in this place. <laughs> yeah, man. Wait for that sun to go down. Why does it have to get dark at 9 o'clock? Exactly. When, we, when it closes is when the sun sets. <laughs> We're getting some Ladybug Farmhouse Blonde. Thank you. What, is, what kind is it there? We got the Farmhouse Blonde, which is the Ladybug, and the Tennessee Premium Lager, which is the home brew. Which one's the best? I like the ladybug a little better. It's got pineapple bones. Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, I'll do that. Cheers! Did you get the ladybug? It's a little strong, right? Yeah, but it's not too hoppy. That one just got poured on the ground because I saw a peach sour, so I'm interested in that one. I don't really want to drink it if I don't like it. There's so many options. We're here getting a peach sour, please. No, she just wants it. You want to show people how. Cool. Oh, I've got a pretzel Slim Jim necklace. That's perfect when you need a snack. <laughs> Genius. Good idea. I wish I had one. We're at the Blunt Country Home Brewery. I'm getting the Funk Berry. The crowds are definitely picking up around here. Lots of people. I got my funk berry. What'd you get? Rocket fuel. Rocket fuel. Let's try it. It's, it's weird. It's weird. Mine's weird. What do you think about yours, Kim? I don't even know what it tastes like. Sold. Sold. <laughs> Tell me what that tastes like. Is it for punch or not? <laughs> ah, uh oh, <laughs> take a sip, pass it around. It's not bad, it just, it's just weird. Yeah. Cheers. Rocket fuel. Cheers. Rocket fuel. Rocket fuel. Did it take me to the moon? Probably. Dream on, baby. I think I got a designated driver here with us. I know. She's got her coat. <laughs> I saw a lavender stout, so I got it for Erin. She likes stouts sometimes, so we'll see. If not, we don't drink it. Nice work. You like, like it? You don't like any stuff. I don't even understand what you got. It one. smells good. <laughs> no, it's not horrible. Right? It's not that bitter. It smells good. Can you can you smell it? Can you smell it? <laughs> smell a vision. Smell a vision. It smells like lavender. So you were able to leave the vent in the back corner over here, and they have public restrooms, as well as porta potties at the front of the event. So. Yay for places to go to the bathroom. This really is a great event. We love being able to try all the different kinds of beers they have here. But there is so many different ones to try. There's no way to be able to try them all. And not all of them even fill your cup either. So you're just getting like a good sample. So I've even heard that some of these uh, beer places, the beer's being made in their garages. So that's fun. Yay for garage beer. 
Starting to drizzle for sure. Oh, there's another guy with the pretzel necklace. Okay, everybody has these pretzel necklaces here. Is this like a Tennessee thing? Like, you know, I've been to a lot of festivals and stuff, but I haven't seen the whole pret pretzel necklace thing before, but everybody has them here. It's hilarious. Look, there's more right here, all these people. I guess it's a Tennessee thing. I don't know, it's a great idea. I wish someone would have told me. So apparently the pretzel necklaces are like a beer fest thing. So good to know. Look, more of them. Everybody has them. I feel so left out. All I've got to say is now the weather feels amazing. There's a breeze out. It only drizzled for literally like a second, felt a couple drops, and that was it. So I think the night will be a little more enjoyable now without the heat. So stay tuned, folks. For some more craft beer. The heavens just opened up. I just I got more food. And it started for I'm hiding under this beer tent. Tennessee Brew Works. Thanks so much for the cover. The friends are over there. Oh, it literally just like opened up and started pouring. Everybody ran for cover. What'd you get? I got some chocolate moon pie from Naked River Brewery. Chocolate moon pie. yummy so just want to say one thing it's 7 30 right now i was complaining about the food earlier but it was a good thing we ate because the food's gone yeah there's only veggies left the unlimited food is gone at 7 30 and this event's till nine o'clock so there's people here who didn't even get to eat at all i hope you didn't just show up because you're gonna be hungry yeah i like, paying 55 dollars yeah crazy kim How's it going? Delicious. Having a good time. I went and got, I went and got the scraps. It was cheese and salsa and chips. That was, <laughs> that's what's left out at 7.30. Get what you get and you don't get upset. It's still really good. And all the food is from Salsa Rita's and it was delicious. Salsa Rita's. You got your shirt, girl? You got our t-shirts that come with our tickets. Yeah, it's pretty, it's cute. I like that it's Absolutely. green. Yeah, it's nice. It'll be fun it for St. Patrick's Day. Not 100% cotton, thank God. It's only 60% yeah. cotton, 40% yeah. polyester, so. Nice, Both yeah. Good. I think so. Yay. And good thing you grabbed it now before they run out of t-shirts, yeah. too. FYI, if you come here next year, get everything you want. As soon as you get here, otherwise it's not yeah, gonna be low. Talked to other people, and they said that they thought it was gonna be all you can eat as right? well. Yeah, and they didn't. It's not. They lacked a little communication and organization. I would say this year, maybe after the pandemic, maybe it made it a little rough for them. But we're still having a good time. Yeah. Woo! Let's go get a beer. Do it. Time for another beer. We just took a little break, sat down, relaxed. Now we're gonna do another round. It's a really fun event though. Everybody's out here having a great time. Hops in the hills. All right, what you got here? So we got a tart cherry cider. It's gonna start out tart but finish out sweet, which is nice. Okay. And then we got a semi-dry. So it's not too dry, it's not too sweet. It's an easy drinking cider. Easy drinking. I'll do the easy drinking. You got it. <laughs> Somebody's not behaving. Are they coming back, guys? 
people drink a little too much. Yeah. Karen, I, I dare you to ask someone from a, a pretzel from their pretzel I necklace. Off their shit. I want you to do that. It's COVID times. It's weird. <laughs> Black Horse, we're getting the side hustle sour. We ate at this restaurant. Here we go. Thank you. Thank you. Side hustle. It's almost nine o'clock. I think this may be the last one. We go uh, chill and listen to some music. Hope everyone's having a great night. We are. fun um a little unorganized in our opinion from the mm -hmm. beginning because we didn't really understand the food situation they said on oh, me but it really wasn't that um you kind of had to work to get your like shirt to and your other picture, things yeah. that were involved but we had a great time the music the band was awesome mm -hmm. did a lot of cover songs we really enjoyed it yeah our generation music yeah was good. like yeah. spoke to us so i guess that's the kind of like the demographic for this mm -hmm. festival but we had a great for time sure. for sure Sure, I'm sure. happy we decided to do it. Yeah, so definitely I think this is like a yearly event here in Maryville. Yeah. So definitely be sure to check it out next year if you're in this area. Mm -hmm. For sure. So if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new here and hope you all have a great night. We'll see you in the next episode. Bye! Bye.